you know, you see this shit. You, you got supers here in the mid lane. And you gotta, you gotta push against them. We got the Baron up. Um, so that's pretty much what I gotta do. I gotta push this lane. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I don't care about killing them. All I care about is pressure. That's all I care about here. Yeah. All right, so I recognize that this I have to jack supers. So I'm not gonna be here to push. I just wanna I just wanna push it about halfway here and I'm just gonna go bot while the dragon is up and I'm gonna end the game. That's my plan. It may not work, but that that is the plan. And it should work. It should work. Alright, so I, I start heading there now. Alright, so now it's time to push. And they're all busy at the dragon here. They actually do see me, they signal. Um, but it looks like they're too busy here. If they don't, they don't know I, I'm strong enough to end the game. So they're all just too busy fighting. And here we go. Classic Shinebreaker moment. Demolish damage. Ha! Huh. TP. It's over. Now they're trying to recall. And look at, look at, look at. She's trying to end the game. Oh no! Oh no! That was like. Let's go back. Look at. She tried so hard to end the game. That wasn't even close. That wasn't even close, man. <laughs> oh my god. That's a classic. That is a classic. This is why I play Bobby Bear this way, guys. This is why I play Bobby Bear. Nobody else is getting shit done on a map. Okay? And when you get a game like this where they're almost ending the game on you, Bolly Bear, all it takes is one Bolly Bear to end the game. That's it. <laughs> so the game isn't over, so it's over. Welcome back to another Shinebreaker video. We're going to be playing the classic Shinebreaker playstyle, the Stormbreaker. And this one's going to be using uh, Iceborne, which is a great counter to champions like this little Furby creature here. League of Draven? Nah, I'm sorry, buddy. It's gonna be the League of Bears. I'm gonna show you at 20 minutes of the game. I transform into the Big Bear. There we go. Got the E damage on him. Not quite yet. I'm gonna wait on the, the next trade. Get a little too close. Got my Ghost and Ignite. That should be enough. Yep. Alright. Got the ignite chomp, and he doesn't have flash. <laughs> yeah, that was exactly the play I was looking for. Another play, got the tower down halfway. And we got 9 ability haste from that dragon. 9% attack speed, that's a really good one. Probably one of the best dragons to have on Bolly Bear, actually. Yep. There we go. Ain't going nowhere. He has flash now, so you know now is a good time to force it out. And I'll be able to kill him on the next. He he has to flash here. Yeah, I think he's gonna flash over the wall. All so close. Yeah. Alright, so we'll flash it down. If he stays, he's dead. And I think he is gonna stay for some reason. I don't know. I don't know. He looks like he's actually going back. He has TP, so. Okay. Oh my god. So I tried to get him on my E. So now that he jumps out of the way, watch this. Oh, oh my god. 
god, why didn't he just... He, he had TP. He had teleport. All he had to do was go back, come back with, uh, you know, full health. And life is good, but... Okay. <laughs> hey, I got ghost. I know he doesn't have flash. There's no way he can get away from me. <laughs> oh, the TP! What a classic move there. He got so lucky, but you know what? That's fine. It, it's down. His flash and his TP is down. There's, there's no way he's going to be able to fight me. I'm going to go over here and get the condom. Mr. Condom guy over here. Oh, got cornered. Ooh, looks to make a play here. Unlucky. Could have gotten that kill or would have been worth to die there. Uh oh. Okay, stopped at me. I'm just gonna ult and then fly away. Uh, see if I can... oh, ooh, splash? Uh, I don't have ghosts, so it's pretty hard to, like, challenge two of them. So I'm just gonna have to get my team. Uh, try to get out of here. W, walk away, I should be able to heal again. Uh, actually, <laughs> I should have just kept walking away, but I, I guess I didn't know how many were coming up here. So I signaled them to start working Dragon Side, because it's gone. There's nothing we can do about this. So if this, this is the, at the point where I want to pressure, I'm just going to push and kind of loop around here, and hopefully I can catch her. Yeah, she can't see me in the fog of war, so I should be able to sneak up. Because she's going to want to go help her friends out uh, with the dragon. Alright, here we go. Oh, oh, leaped away. Okay. Yeah, I should probably, I should probably know better. She, she has an easy out. So now my wave's up here and I can't do anything about this pressure. So look at me go back and forth in circles. Like, what do I do? What do I do? And now I'm like, fuck it. I'll just go help my team. It's going to take me forever just to get this and go down here. So I decided to go scan and, and see if I can help. Maybe get, get a kill. Alright, so I focused the condom. <laughs> so I got that kill, but I die in the process here. Um, I'm lucky. So next time, don't I don't need to make this kind of play against a champion that can, you know, easily get away. So what instead what I should do is push this wave and force force her to fight under tower here. And I, I have ghost and everything, I can chase her down. Um, and, and completely dive and kill her on the tower. Disable the tower. Uh, Baron's up in like 10 seconds. It's big bear time. Boom. The big bad worm. And I have enough gold for Titanic. And that's the huge power spike. Uh, especially on the W and Q. And then you ult during that time. Uh, when you ult, you actually deal extra damage. Uh, and then, um, during that time, your QW, your auto is hit like a truck. And they deal increased damage because the volleyball has, uh, health in it. So the more health you have on Titanic, the more damage you're gonna deal. Including with, uh, Demolish on the towers. It's a big deal. It's one of the volleyball's strongest items. Because that's what they're doing. They're, they're doing this because they're like, oh, it's, it's five versus four. And I don't know what she's doing farming here, but she needs to get in there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this tower. I still don't know why she's not in there. I got that tower. Um, fortunately, the enemy has the Baron. Uh, I'm gonna focus on this, uh... 
third tower in the bot lane. I get it about halfway. I see the Baron buff here, so I'm just going to back off. And I'm going to keep pressure here because my team is here trying to take the mid tower. Probably good enough. And we're gonna go back and start working on the hall breaker. Got powerful damage on the demolish. Demolish right now, 1,329. It's pretty big. Gonna get bigger. Alright, Leona's here, which is the CC. For the enemy team, they're, they're lacking CC there, so I think he's serious shit for that. Looks like we actually do. Should be able to win this fight. So I'm just gonna stay here and keep Le Leona <laughs> out of a team fight. I don't know why she's here. Alright, looks like we got our. Uh, unfortunately, the jungler died, so we're not gonna be able to take this yet. Alright, I'm gonna start working on this tower here. I might be able to take this down. I don't think Leona can do anything about it. Ah, uh, maybe not. Maybe I can get it about halfway, because, uh... Christiana spawned. Alright, I'm gonna back off. I have Ghost if I want to get away. Looks like I'll be alright. Oh, no. It's alright. At least I'll be able to take the tower. Yeah, looks like we lost that fight. Someone got caught. So this will go down easy with Demolish. There we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna back off. It's not worth dying over. I can take that any time. So I got enough gold for... Uh, Hallbreaker. We're pretty much ready to break the game at any moment now. Getting caught like this and dying. So I'm just gonna keep pushing anyway and keep a close eye. But it's unfortunate because they look like they're gonna be able to take the mid and the inhibitor maybe. I'm gonna do my best to take this inhibitor if I can. I just gotta dodge him and maybe try to attack him. Yeah, try to scare him off, got the leap away. And if he gets too close, I can kill him. So I'm just gonna focus on getting this. And I actually do have to go back. Unfortunately. Oh my god, it's so close. It is so close. Yeah, so I'm going back. I'm gonna charge in. And try to stop her from taking the Nexus. Oh damn Jesus Christ, how many escapes does she have? That is broken. Let's take a look at her. what is she? Oh, 14 kills, 650, that would be a nice bounty. It, oh, Lord Dom, yeah, that'll do it. Yeah, that'll do it. Uh, when, you know, you see this shit, you, you got supers here in the mid lane, and you gotta, you gotta push against them. You got the Baron up. Um, so that's pretty much what I gotta do. I gotta push this lane. What are you guys doing over there? Getting caught. So I'm gonna get Trithiana here. And, uh, you know, chase him down. Uh, what item? Oh, he has a slow item. So I might not be able to get him, actually. But that's okay. I'm still gonna push. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I don't care about killing him. All I care about is pressure. That's all I care about here. Alright, so I recognize that this, I have to jack supers. So I'm not going to be here to push. I just want to I just want to push it about halfway here, and I'm just going to go bot while the dragon is up, and I'm going to end the game. That's my plan. It may not work, but that that is the plan. And it should work should work. Alright, so I, I start heading there now. 
So I gotta remain in the fog of war until the, the dragon actually spawns, and then I push. I do have ghost coming up, so I could just rush up to the lane. And when you have ghosts, you can just com quickly kill the, the wave and run into the fog of war so they don't see you. Alright, so now it's time to push, and they're all busy at the dragon here. They actually do see me, they signal. Um, but looks like they're too busy here. And they don't, they don't know I, I'm strong enough to end the game. So they're all just too busy fighting. And here we go. Classic Shinebreaker moment. Oh! Oh my god. Big demolish damage. Ha! Huh. TP. It's over. Now they're trying to recall. And look at, look at, look at. She's trying to end the game. Oh no. Oh no. That was like, let's go back. Look at, she tried so hard to end the game. That wasn't even close. Blue team's turret has been destroyed. That wasn't even close, man. <laughs> oh my god. That's a classic. That is a classic. This is why I play volleyball this way, guys. This is why I play volleyball. Nobody else is getting shit done on a map. Okay? And when you get a game like this where they're almost ending the game on you, volleyball, all it takes is one volleyball to end the game. That's it. So the game isn't over until it's over. Uh, decent KDA uh, and farm. So, you know, the damage isn't really the focus. The damage is there. We have the damage. We're just split pushing a lot. Um, tower damage, that's where it's at. Wham. See how much pressure we're putting on the map there? Nobody's doing jack shit. All they're doing is fighting. <laughs> Objectives. Look at me. I'm pretty much the jungler at this point. <laughs> Oh, God. Anyway, here's the classic runes for Stormbreaker playstyle. Um, the, the original Shinebreaker uh, build. So we uh, run we run uh, Nashua's after the Hallbreaker and then uh, Demonic. Uh, alternative to Demonic, you can run Sunfire. That's, that's uh, pretty good. But the reason why we go Demonic is because more AP for Nashers, more attack speed on the passive, and more AoE damage, and you get burn. Um, and also, Demonic works in the same way as Titanic does with his ult. When you gain health, you're going to get more AP, more damage. So a bigger boom and uh, you know AoE damage combination when you do the E and R combo. That's pretty much why I go... Uh, demonic as the last item and uh once you go um nashers you get the um the sorcery pot and before that before nashers you want to go the iron pot as more health on titanic the better but after nashers you pretty much your goal is to deal um uh, true damage to the towers and uh just have more attack speed in general so that's pretty much how this playstyle is.